Did you make a Rajkumar Rao joke reference in the middle? <laughs> yeah. Is this what's going to happen to this show? I mean, should we really carry on? A lot of people don't know that you were um, an icon in advertising in terms of modeling. Uh, oh. He has dated no, a couple of Bollywood that's actresses. Not, that's not what Can I said. Go? So their cuisine is vaster. They have vaster. Been vaster. Guys, Google vaster. <laughs> this is an English pandit. Huh? This is the man who destroys the Marathi. English what? Pandit. <laughs> pandit. Like, Come on. Like Pandit Jawaharlal. Vaster. I'm, 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 I'm waiting for vaster. Don't try to throw it back on vaster. me. Vaster. Vaster. Vast, vaster, uh, vastest. You, you bloody vaster. <laughs> uncle, uncle. You're running on air. I'm sorry, crying. Get. It's a baby. Okay. I would normally say super excited to be on the show but uh, and we had fantastic guests lined up we had the young riya chakraborty we had a possibility of sharukh khan and then we also had a foreign comedian from england whose name i forget so we had lots of people who may come or would have come but for whatever reason basically air india they weren't able to make it here in the meantime this is almost the first time i'm doing a guest episode in the new year 2024 and uh, lucky for us somebody was in the neighborhood because in this building where we have ivm there's also a plastic surgeon uh, <laughs> on the i won't say the floor this gentleman was going in for his regular treatment i mean just hair follicles in the nose and ear and that kind of thing and then we stopped him and kunal you were nice enough to say okay i'll i'll fill in and we will start the year with you in a sense uh, could you tell list. me which is my camera first this one this one th okay this one okay okay it doesn't matter Fine. kunal you're here as an audio person okay, okay. <laughs> by now you should understand that your visual beauty has receded over the years uh, it's increased over the years well you can say that but you're covering a very important point here but that's because our buttons are popping yeah, he man. has a belly and a navel which is open as we all do <laughs> and he's feeling that it's not right to showcase this in 2024 continuously so occasionally i can show it but continuously Fair it may enough. be and this is, you're the new this is the new kunal this is you've changed now which is what you become more fashion conscious and you're careful about how you look no, no i was always fashion conscious extremely careful about how i look and you fell under the spell of one young man who didn't give a fuck <coughs> oh my god the coughing has started already this show is going to be very well hard. let me let me tell you one thing oh, look, there is a lot of coughing in this show yeah. because i have a bad throat so it's yeah. going to be continuous well, not sporadic well when you say bad throat is not like the rest of the body is not spectacular <laughs> no it's not like he's got a i got a great pair of abs or something i mean i mean the bad throat let's just leave it there you know i don't want to sound yeah. vicious okay uh, now please understand if you're listening for the first time we have a certain relationship uh, let's call it a situationship <laughs> and so we take uh, liberties with each other and there's a lot of name calling and abusing which you might find a little putrid at first then you'll realize after one hour that you'd like to do the same uh but this episode i'm not even sure why we're doing it but we'll get into it because they you have nobody else true, true, true. no but the meat of the episode generally we have a guest the guest has some achievements we uh -huh. talk about that or something to present uh -huh. but you had let's look at your year first and then we'll try and look at the world in general mm -hmm. through the eyes of kunal bijekar um so you had this food show's done pretty well you've got uh, millions of subscribers and well, uh, i traveled. don't have millions of subscribers but we've got a decent amount of so subscribers you, your your niece maya my daughter keeps uh, showing me kunal's got 1 million views 2 million views <laughs> then she shows me my insta you've got 7 <laughs> views 3 <laughs> so likes but there are two there is a difference you show your body i show what i power what is more attractive well, some my wife would say what's the difference really? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so that there is some some things which which people okay, like humble and take us back a little bit to the food journey because we've spoken to you last about it more than a year ago uh what i you just came back from if i remember correctly you were in udaipur udaipur yeah. and you were the guest of the maharaja the maharaja the bistu udaipur doesn't have a maharaja okay history lesson coming soon go the, they have a maharana maharana now because the they difference? consider the, the 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 maharana is the guy who came second in the finals of the royal <laughs> thing the rana up and no. then there's like the raja and the rana up so uh, he'll never come on the show so rishi <laughs> we've lost one guest huh. so udaipur believes that god is the maharaja and oh, they are nice. the representatives of the maharaja of the maharanas nice nice so and he's the maharanas it's all so the indian government also believes the same thing no yes but this is a little disputed because we don't know the so who did we meet in the, end, the maharana the maharana's son the what's his title son of maharana they don't have titles any more cyrus well they don't really yeah. but they do na but yeah no the, i don't the, the gentry I, around them I think do Mahara pay obeisance and all that prince rajkumar or something was yeah not you, rajkumar what did, rao what did you call him i called him by his name did you make a rajkumar rao joke <laughs> reference in the middle yeah. is this what's going to happen to <laughs> the show i mean should we really carry on so you called him by his first name yeah okay yeah. all right So tell us a little bit about Rajasthan and what you did there. So no, so uh, Udaipur uh, is. Uh, Explain the. I don't, everyone doesn't know 
about the whole it, it is the water body and you cross it and yeah. so this is the thing uh, udaipur is very close to gujarat so when you think of rajasthan you normally think of sand people say it's actually dry. more gujarat in the in, it is yeah. it is even in the in the food and in the language yeah. so it's a green and uh, uh, fertile land unlike uh, large parts of rajasthan which are sandy and desert right um so the food that if i was to get into details of the food when you, you talk about you know tell about me about the journey because I want, to, I, i want to see pictures of you on a boat you know the small boats oh, that ferry you across the lake very nice it yeah. is yeah so do you get scared no why it's, because it's a small boat and you're a big man but it's a very it's a question of physics it's a very calm lake yeah. there's no there are no currents or anything you're going nice like a maharaja across the so, across uh, maharana the water, you mean maharana yeah, just be careful yeah ha yeah. huh. so it was nice the weather was cold and the food was great and uh, yeah there are a lot of palaces is beautiful and uh, And now you reach Udaipur. This is the first time you've gone. He's gone there many times. We've been Ma- together, Cyrus. Yeah, but yeah, that's right. We have been. We've lived separate stayed, boats. Separate no, boats. We stayed in the same uh, Lake Palace, Udaipur, that's together. Right, that's right. We, we won't get into that. Yeah, we we had to share a room because theater is tough. But we did share yeah. a room. Not just us, eleven people. Yeah. And only six of us were like one gender. Which people, theater group ever took you to the Lake Palace, Udaipur? Cyrus? I can't remember you anything. Remember. I I struggle to remember anything in 2023. But I want to continue because I keep interrupting you when you're trying to tell us about the food of Udaipur being distinctly different from the rest. And you hmm. were saying because when you think of Rajasthani food, commonly you think of lal mas, which everybody seems Overdone, to have lal mas. Yeah, For us, everybody says it's, it's the only thing they tell us. Yeah. Kher sangri and that gatte ki sabzi, but there is so much more because Udaipur is not desert, so kher sangri is not really big. Kher sangri mm. is a dried vegetable or herb or shrub or something. My God, <laughs> I've been called worse. Yeah. <laughs> dried vegetable and yeah. gatte ki sabzi is made. I've dated a few. Yeah, uh, besan, huh. but so their cuisine is vaster. They have vaster, vaster. <laughs> Guys, Google vaster. This is an English pandit. Huh? This is the man who destroys the Marathi. English what? Pandit, <laughs> pandit, like, come on, like Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Vaster, I'm, 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 I'm waiting for Vaster. Don't try to throw it back on vaster. me. Vaster, Vaster, Vast, Vaster, uh, Vastest. You, you bloody Vaster. <laughs> <laughs> huh. And uh, yeah, so uh, much more cuisine over there. And hmm. we did a little bit of very, very simple jungly mutton, hmm. which can be cooked literally with only three ingredients. So it's fabulous. What are the three ingredients? Red chilies, salt, and ghee. Wow! Nothing else, and the mutton, of course. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. I mean, you need important mutton. ingredient to put in there, right? But very simple. You should try it at home because everybody, I mean, even you, can put three things together and light a fire. You see how he does that. Even you, <laughs> condescending. He tries not to be insulting, but he's very insulting. <laughs> I at least am openly insulting. It's more like mischief. This is a mean person, but now you get it. As the show goes on, you'll get the meanness, the malice intended. Always. All right. Uh, yeah. So, what what has been in 2023? What do you think has been the highlight of your year? What did you do professionally that was great? I don't know. I think you do a lot of events. I, You've I, been judging a lot of events, and no, no, I'm not. I haven't really judged any events. Went to Delhi and judged an event for two days just the week before. No, no. So there were awards that I was judging, right? Which is great. Which is uh, an event. Oh. Yeah, but it's not like anyway. No, no. The good, the good thing about the whole year is that this channel has taken off. It's mm. something that I've really liked doing. I missed after the food show shut down, and I was mm. a little angry and bitter about not having a food. Uh, This is that food show on Times Now called yeah, the Foodie. Yeah, correct. Yeah, yeah which uh, when Ornob was the editor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, correct. Yeah, right, he, I right. forgot he's no longer the editor. Yeah, he started is, his own is, channel. Is it true that uh, to get the job you were asked to come to his bungalow in Mud Island? Ornob Goswami was a bungalow in Mud Island. Nobody I didn't know. Knows. You've been there? I made it. Oh, you made it. Okay. I built it brick by brick. <laughs> Because so, he claims that you stole all his revenue by. Pretending to be him and all his money. Well, not just me. Like everybody else on news television. <laughs> so, so, I mean, there's a hell of a lot of yeah, or a lot, lot of me too. There. So anyway, you did that show for some time, and then uh, there was a uh, break. I can't remember how many years. Several years, years, actually. Seven years. There was no. Several. Uh, I uh, we stopped in two, about six years at least. I think. Okay. And six then, year break. But when you come back, there's this whole glut of young bloggers and food bloggers and. Almost everybody mm. has some sort of, and food is something everybody wants to take yeah. uh, possession of. Yeah, it's there like, is, there is. But well, you know what there is besides young food bloggers and all. There are very a lot of local bloggers and vloggers or whatever they hmm. or Instagrammers the or whatever. What's the difference? Is it purely Bengali Bihari, vlo and blur kind of thing? Let me ask the uh, uh, Bihari friend here. A blogger to vlogger, बोलते कहीं? Blogger, a blogger. अच्छा, so there's blogger, there's blogger, and there's vlogger. Yeah. 
ब्लॉगर ब्लॉगर यूज्ड टू विदाउट वीडियो ब्लॉगर इज विद वीडियो बट आई थिंक व्हाट दे कॉल्ड नाउ दे आर कॉल्ड इंस्टाग्रामर्स नाउ आई थिंक ओ बट एवर नो माय पॉइंट इज यू आई हैड दैट सो लॉट ऑफ लोग यू टॉप ऑफ द ट्री in a sense you know too many people on and uh, you were very distinctly different there was sanjeev kapoor of course but it was more like a babar chi kind of thingy yeah. cooking and stuff yeah. you were the connoisseur like representing the people uh, <laughs> sorry guys every time he coughs please yeah. take a two second break everybody because it's horrendous and painful if in the making of the show he does pass away <laughs> we will definitely make that uh, lal mas Yeah, it'll be a good episode. You will get lots of views if that was. Bro, I will have two minutes of silence yeah. first time on my show. That much respect to show. I've never had two minutes silence, and we've had some horrible guests. You know that. All right. Um, uh, so the young. My point was that the, all these young Turks had come. We had discussed this also, yeah. and they, everybody and their father had come on the show and on the internet and mm. presenting food. It's and they still are, and then you have to come back. And so, but you quickly reclaimed your equity. One would think it would have been a challenge. I don't know how it happened. And honestly, while the team, uh, the team is relatively younger than I am, yeah, which I'm assuming helps. Everybody is. <laughs> we are now kind of people that you know. We really should be in the Rajya Sabha. I'm mean, just waiting for my call up. Honestly, yeah. and after one Padma Shri also would be no Padma Bhushan. All three we should yeah, get. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Maybe simultaneously the only people to get it. Correct. All three Padmas, Brocha yeah. Vijaykar, stand up. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> So, uh, so I think uh, it's uh, got to do a lot with the young team, mm. and because I honestly, to God, I've done exactly. I'm doing exactly the same thing I was doing ten years ago and fifteen years ago, mm. eating and talking about food. Mm. So it's not like I have reinvented myself or something. Mm. But uh, maybe the younger people have reinvented the way it's presented. Yeah. So it seems to have worked. Also, there's a one criticism, only one, uh, about the show, and that is you have a very refined way of speaking Hindi. This is coming from me. Whose Hindi is well? It's not even Hindi. But can you tell us what went into that deep thought that you put into the way you present it when you we would do a lot of it. Eighty percent is in Hindi, so well, uh, n- uh, no longer. I'm trying to reduce the Hindi because I just you couldn't bear your own Hindi. <laughs> yes, I couldn't. He's like, those two, nahi nahi, friends. I couldn't. So it's so I I I've decided we've. <laughs> We battled about it. अब अब कुनाल विजयकर की हिंदी में हर का सा एग्जाम्पल हम हम हमने बहुत सोचा इसके बारे में और हम ये पर वो पंपोसिटी नहीं आ रहे हैं डिसीजन पर आ गए हैं पंपोसिटी के साथ बात करना वो जो हम जो आप प्रोजेक्ट करते हैं ना आप इसमें मैं इधर आ गया गैंगजिस के सामने आई वांट दैट दैट्स व्हाट वी ऑल गैंगजिस के सामने इस ऑलवेज वन इंग्लिश वर्ड इस वन इंग्लिश वर्ड व्हिच इज ब्यूटीफुली प्रोनाउंस्ड सो आई एम डूइंग द ऑपोजिट नाउ सो आई वी आई एम होल्डिंग बिकॉज़ आई एम गिविंग स्पर्श टाइम टू प्लेस अ लिटिल बिट ऑफ योर गाने में क्या है लेट देम टेस्ट इट ओके वॉच दिस You can say that. Huh. And then, yeah. No, no. So uh, uh, the the whole the of, the view of the team was that Hindi is widely watched, so you should do it. You communicate with more people. You communicate with more people. It's a wider audience. But slowly, slowly, this is what I started feeling: is that this medium is a little more personal. Is what is got to do with what you are huh. and how you. Let's say your show. Your yeah. show is you. Yeah. So if what I'm doing is not me, then I. I'm just uncomfortable doing. You're enjoying it. that. Please don't take it away. I've taken it away. Don't do that. Just because you're, you're, you're laughing at my show. I no, no. no why? Everyone you're has told me that. They me. love it. I mean, everywhere I go, when people talk about the show, sooner or later, if they're closing off, they start saying, "Bro, we love okay, the way." I'll do what every time. And they tell me, <laughs> <laughs> like, like, like you know, I'm like I wrote the book on Hindi. <laughs> so I'm I'm going to try and do it. As com- in a language that I'm comfortable with, huh. and if I'm speaking to people who are Hindi speaking, then hmm. I will speak in Hindi. Is it true you fall asleep during some of the interviews? Uh, this interview is that <laughs> close. This one, you know, I won't let him see. This, to this that. one, I won't let him see. But he has. Uh, <laughs> there are stories. There are great stories. I've, I, the thing is, I can't sleep at night. But in the middle of things, I tend to fall asleep. Yeah. Okay. Come to health. Uh, I, another segment I had in my head was because people who watch this show, Cyrus says, and they know the relationship and your your personality is better known, I think, on my show than on your show. Because I don't know how much they know about you personally on your show, but all, no, this show, all the regulars know everything about you personally. Mm. And one thing they love is your lack of interest in sport. So I thought, let's have a little uh, conversation about sports in general, okay. and and see where you stand, and just be open and honest. I mean, mm. we had Farah coming on, Farah Khan, mm. and she wasn't that comfortable, but she was very bindas, and we got lots of people w- tuning in saying, "Wow, that was fun." Mm. Okay, let's talk about the South African team chosen to play in New Zealand Test team. Which has really? eight new faces with Ni- Nigel Brand, I think, as the uncapped captain. W- what do you think that leaves us in terms of red ball cricket and the lack of respect across the world? 
<laughs> one of the biggest controversies in 2024 is the New Zealand tour by South Africa who were bowled out for 55 by India and immediately like a karmic slap uh, sent this ridiculous team because they have no interest and rather play T20 cricket in South Africa. It's okay. Basically, the point is T20 is murdering the five-day game. Okay. Your views? It is. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, I don't like colorful clothes on green lawns. White clothes on green lawns look really nice. That's what you get out of the yeah. sport. So five day cricket with white clothes is nice. Okay, all right. Yeah. So that was Vijaykar on sport. Now we talk about Vijaykar on automation. <laughs> okay, on IBM. Tell us about your show on IBM. I've just been told by a little bird here who wants to promote uh, your show. The podcast is called A Century of Stories, mm -hmm. uh, and it's about unusual, unknown little little snippets of. Indian history, for want of a better word, uh, but there are stories that you did not know about things that you actually know about. Mm -hmm. So, like if we are talking about tigers and conservation of tigers, who was behind it? If right. you're talking about Chandrayaan, who was behind it? How did it happen? If you're uh, talking Chandrayaan about the prime minister, mm -hmm. uh, tigers, the prime minister. Uh, Question is, which prime minister? That doesn't matter. No? The answers are yeah. always the same. Yeah. So. Coming back, coming back to tigers, do you know that there are over 20,000 tigers apparently in the United States of America in captivity? I don't know that. Then what? You don't even research your subject, Baba. No, no. But, come to me when it comes to tigers. It's about India. I don't know. How many tigers are supposed in the last census? 20,000. 20, in India? Yeah. This man, you gave a job. 20,000. This is, this is the kind of... Guys, this is what I'm dealing with. Now, this man is a fraud. I'm here to expose him. Aray, but that episode is not on air yet. But thank I'm God it's not on air. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on air. He's saying, boy, let me tell you how the tiger is being survived and doing all this good... You, you just... You create numbers. How many? How People many have many? died to support the tiger. We are just about 3,000 tigers at best. You read it in the Wait, what, what are you talking about? Sparsh is having a heart attack. This young kid has come from Delhi. He used to add stars in his eyes. He's a great man. He saw your ads. He saw your TV work. And then this is it. Look, I'm sorry. I'm you made up a figure. Bittu Saigal is shooting himself in the foot right now. <coughs> Uh, oh, again I, the cough. I, oh. I, I, I'm numeric, numeric. This is the only show we have more coughs than jokes. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> Numerically challenged. Uh. So my numbers are a little off. Okay. Okay. But you're very positive. You but just my, made it 20,000. But my, but my sort of, what is it? Sentiment is all there. Right. Okay. It's a number. This is after reading a script with everything given. Okay. <laughs> just to be sure. It's like the information is given to him and still not sent out. Uh -huh. That's Tigers. There are some. What episodes are close to your heart? There was one on cricket for which IBM had a meeting later, uh -huh. saying it was whether very, he's the right person. It, no, or it was just for all of them were questioning whether they should start narcotics immediately. Uh, my uh, close to my heart is the the Rasgulla controversy episode, which was a nice episode. Right, uh, which is between uh, the famous. We've discussed it ten times. Yeah. But we quickly between Bengal and Odisha and Bengal Odisha. And with, with Odisha taking the. Yeah. Is, is it no, fair to say? No, Bengal got uh, won the won the thing, but Odisha objected, and then finally they had to give it to both. So Bengal didn't get a no objection certificate from Odisha. Is what yeah. you're saying? And so now shared, like in India, we it's go. Shared, yeah. It's like my BIS school where my kids were. Everything, everybody wins. You have a race, everybody gets a medal. Yeah. Well, at the end why of the upset day, people? Yeah, why upset people? Uh, in the meantime, you do, you do want to pee, I presume. So yes, we will take a yes, short break yeah. and then come back and talk some more. He will get some coaching in that little break. Okay. This is a very good human being. <laughs> despite what you've seen, what happens with age is we do start losing our ability to... Faculties. Faculties and all that challenge. So Sparsh and Rishi, Abhay sir, all of you all don't make fun. You're all coming to the same, you know, situation in life. Okay, <laughs> but <laughs> no, but but oh, okay. He's got a story. We we'll interrupt the proceedings. Yeah, yeah. We'll we'll hold this. Go ahead. Yeah. So the first talkie, Alamara. Hmm. Uh, the first he talkie. The, Mother Hindi India, the talkie film. The first Indian talkie film. Huh. It was in Hindi or what, Bengali Hindi, or what? Hindi, okay. Hindi, 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 huh. Hindi, and uh, Mother India. Which went to the Oscars as the first, first India time, pick. Uh, f first time the Oscars had the category of foreign language film. Okay. And uh, Mother India did not win. Yeah. Fellini's some Italian film won. Well, can you blame it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fellini, <laughs> Mother India. I don't no, know. Fellini huh? and. Uh, now, now don't suddenly act like you know everything. With twenty minutes, you've been exposed as a fraud. Listen, I've just oh. forgotten the name of the director. Okay, so. <laughs> 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 I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. Mehmood Khan. Now, don't say no, I know. It's not Mehmood. Yeah, Mehmood Khan. Mehboob. Listen, listen. Named don't, after. Don't don't pick on me now. Mehboob Studios. Named no, after. no, you the fraudulent Vijaykar has been exposed. I am so. Happy. <laughs> I want these little links. I'm going to keep them on my phone, and when I'm bored, I'm just going to watch. 
So huh. that was great. Mother India. So one good story came out of all this. Yeah. But Mother India didn't did not win anything in the end uh, no, abroad. But won everything in India. Yeah, but the yeah. film uh, was uh, sort of had a lot of firsts in it. Can you, you know name six? Yeah, six. No, I can name three if you want. <laughs> go for three. Go for three. I have started up and then I have lowered the bar ko lower kar immediately. Huh? First time woman protagonist. Female protagonist. Uh, female, okay. female protagonist. Second. First, first time technicolor. Huh. Um, first time. Uh, you said three, huh? Angry, Angry young man. Angry young man played by Sunil Dutt. Oh, so he's the original Angry young man, you're saying? Yeah. Before our angry young man, I said my generation ka angry young man. Now mm. that animal and all is out, so many angry yeah. young men. Or and our angry young man has retired from KBC, which is so sad. sad. But maybe he'll know. come back. I, I hope he does. They may next year. You but Mr. Bachchan, if you're listening and you have nothing to do, Cyrus says we have a chair waiting for you. You just say the time and the place. And trust me, when you tell us a story, it'll be a proper story, <laughs> not like <laughs> this guy. Or right, we're taking a quick break uh, because he needs to uh, uh, drain the. Snake. Hey, it's been another great week on the IVM Podcast Network. On Cyrus Says, Cyrus is joined by author Abhishek Bhatt, who shares insights into his latest book, The Indian Punter League. He reveals the behind-the-scenes dynamics of the IPL, as well as the inner workings of the world of cricket and betting. Cricket fans should not miss this episode. On Paisa Vesa, Anupam is joined by Saurabh Mukherjee, founder and CIO of Marcellus Investment Managers. Saurabh shares insights about the wealthiest families of India and gives some interesting facts about the highest selling detergent brand in India. Folks, if you like our shows, spread the word. Tell your friends and don't forget to rate and review them wherever you're listening to them. Follow us on social media. We are IVM Podcasts on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and LinkedIn. You'll also find all our shows on youtube.com slash IVM Podcasts. And finally, we would like to thank our sponsors this week. Omediar Network India, Abbott, IDFC First Bank and Save Life Foundation. Thank you for making this possible. Okay, he's back. He's here. The myth and the legend. And I've just been told in that little break that we took from Spurs that the Tiger episode, the Tiger episode where you came up with 20,000 Tigers in India, <laughs> that was recorded with the right figures and all that. 16 minutes before we started recording this. <laughs> Sola minute pehla. See, this is Cyrus. So this means, I, I am in not 16 wearing... minutes, with one set of figures saying 3,000 odd tigers left in India. See, there are two problems. He created, <laughs> Dekhe, sir, both tigers in Hindustan. Mein. <laughs> 25,000. See, to confess, <laughs> I, you know I have a problem with numbers. Yeah. No, I'm, 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 this. I'm seriously ill. So I'm a little clouded at the moment, yeah, yeah, which yeah. is uh, the cause. But and 20,000 and 3,000 is a similar figure. <laughs> <laughs> Animal activists going on hunger strikes for days. <laughs> People trying to do conservation left, right and centre. <laughs> You're saying it's all the same. <laughs> okay. How many Parsis are left in India? Uh, 60,000. But that's not 100% proven. That's uh, just a figure they threw up in the no, air. No, but that's what they I counted 60,000 in Bandra the other day. Parsis? Yeah, I counted uh, John Abraham, Sajid and Farah also. So that adds up a little bit. Okay, yeah. so, but, no, no. but I don't think there'll be, there may be less also. What are you saying? Yeah, I have a feeling. So first your figures are wrong in the Daika community, <laughs> now your figures are wrong in the Parsi community. Yeah. That show is coming on. And yeah. what's your show called, by the way? Uh, which show? The a Century of Stories. Huh, and it's brought to you by? IDFC First Bank. Very good. Uh, always you first. Main cheese to malo mein. Main cheese. Yeah. Okay. Kuna, let's rewind a little bit now. I, I wanted to talk if you have time about the world also uh, uh, in this second week. First week of Jan, we're recording. Uh, but um, let's first get back to your life. A lot of people don't know that you were um, an icon in advertising in terms of modeling. Uh, oh. no, don't laugh. Yeah. Here, here he uh, was very successful. I don't know if we mentioned in the last show we did with you, but you were basically... Uh, I remember attending all these ad functions, the Abbeys or what, what were they called? Ad Club Awards. Ad Club no, Awards. Those days, yeah. yeah, and uh, the predecessor of Model of the Year, uh, there was, in the three years preceding, was uh, Milan Soman, uh, Arjun Rampal, John Abraham. Hmm. Fourth year was Kunal Vijaykar, which puts you in the Adonis's, Adonis size of India. I mean, Milan Soman, please show a picture. Arjun Rampal, picture. <laughs> John Abraham, picture. Kunal Vijaykar and Tigers. <laughs> picture. <laughs> Only my pictures with clothes on. No, but it's a fact. They think I'm lying now, but this is a fact. I wish people can Google that. I don't know if you can. Uh, what is it, Ad Club or Abbey's? It was the same yeah, thing. The Ad Club, which the, then 
so they were called the Abbeys after yeah. that because it was started as the Atlas Awards. So take us back to when you became a sensation because because this I, was before. I never was sensation, so but he, there, there were a couple of ads that did really well. Okay. Okay, he's being modest, but I have to let me let me set this up because you know Abhay has got the same cough that you have, so by the end of the show there'll just be coughing going on. Um, going back to the 90s, mid 90s, just pre my MTV and your uh, other stuff that you were doing, uh, I think you did. Was it still? Correct me if I'm wrong. Still jam ad first. Yeah. Right. The first ad. So. And it's on YouTube. It's on YouTube. Suddenly, it's suddenly, it's and it became. Keep in mind, there's no internet really, so TV is everything, and it's national TV. Mm. So in all channels, all languages, and all. No, there's no language involved. He's crying. So you're wearing a kid's outfit or something, if I remember correctly. No, no. So it was. This, I, I was working in an advertising agency. Right. Okay? And right. Uh, uh, White Light was a very, very prominent production house at that point of right. time. They were doing an ad for Sil Jam, and they want. It was one shot. And they wanted somebody, and somebody recommended my name. I went in the same clothes that I was wearing at office, right? Which was a shirt uh, with a tie and uh, suspenders, and, and no uh, pants, huh? Because <laughs> advertising was wonderful in those days. Huh? <laughs> it was actually wonderful yeah. in those days. And so I rushed from Narayan Point to Famous Studios, uh, sat over there, did that little sequence that they want me to do, and they paid me fifteen hundred rupees for that, which was a decent amount of money. This is nineteen ninety. Three or four. Ninety one. Ninety one. Ninety one. Right, right. When so my salary so itself was two and a half thousand rupees. So correct. Fifteen. So basically, the rupees. Berlin Wall had just collapsed. So these are the two big moments correct. in history. Correct. And still jam ad. Yeah. Then. And uh, but it was a damn good set of directors and. Uh, Shubhir and Namita. Shubhir and Namita, White Light. Yeah. And they ran the ad on everything. So it became very famous. No, no, I think he's being modest again. That's not the reason. I mean, that must have helped. But the no. reason is that his crying, everybody loved it. So we used to have, now my turn to tell stories. Uh, we had a bit of a drinking problem in those days. Every <laughs> Friday night, me and Kunal would go and drink a banned substance called alcohol. I'm saying, do not do this, whatever happens. Unless you're working in the podcast line and not making money, then you have to. But uh, I do remember that whenever we went out on a Friday night, suddenly we'd, we'd go to strange cheap bars where we had no money. And people would come and start impersonating. Yeah. Okay. Now initially, Kunal was very happy with it, like because you're getting little fame and all. Mm. So um, one kid will come and say, "Uncle, uncle, uncle," hey! and yeah, beta, and all that. By about day seven of this happening, I had it. Kunal had it. So one kid came at eight thirty in the night at some cheap bar where kids also turn up for some reason. Uncle, uncle, you're running, don't you? I started crying. Get. It's your father. Okay. I started shouting at him. Huh? <laughs> and you know, I, and I was like, why so much anger? <laughs> the kid just recognized you know, he's acting out. I mean, it's just normal. Uh, you know, it's not very great behavior, yeah. but it's not really bad. Uh, but I've learned from that. You, you're, you're a reluctant star. You don't enjoy it. You enjoy the hotel bookings and all those things, but you don't enjoy these people coming and talking to you. No, no, why I'm, is that, Kunal Vijaykar? I, I sometimes don't. I tend not to be a people's person. Yeah. So and I get embarrassed with over attention. So I feel a little cringy. And I feel shy more than anything else. So the sad part is everybody used to tell me, "Who uh, your jolly friend ka hai?" That's because I, of my face, man. Yeah, but you're not jolly. But you're you are jollier upset. than I am. I wake up with people and go to sleep with you. Yeah. That sounds right. <laughs> <laughs> and as much as Cyrus, he'll put that as a real. Now we're screwed. I, I, huh. Huh. As much as Cyrus says that he hates people and avoids people. And I all, hate people. It's a lie. It's yeah. lies. The, nobody likes people more than Cyrus likes people. Okay. Yeah. The honest truth is, you, you know, that's not a bad thing. It is it's <laughs> not liking actually not liking people, which yeah. is a bad thing. But these are kids, and I remember yeah, you've been so rude but, to them. Yeah, but the, the other point, kids also need to be slapped only. You know. So let me just tell the boys in the studio as well. Then there's the other thing that he used to do is remember this is '91, so autograph was the way you you yeah. know with your hero. Correct. There's no selfie. There's nothing else. Correct. And of course they would bring you know I mean he's not Amitabh Bachchan, so they would just bring a one rupee note or whatever they had, and they would like sir sir sign. Sign, autograph, autograph, and he hated that. Okay, he hated that. Especially, there's more than one. It was two or three. <laughs> it was just too repetitive for him. So by the third one, he first he do, second he do, third he would do this. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, man, it was so embarrassing. Sparsh, you have no idea. People watching, you do not know what this man is. Really, like, it's like a monster. He hates humanity. He's a sociopath, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> really, and nobody knows. Oh, he's so nice, so sweet. You make fun of him, you bully him, you over talk him, you say this, you always demeaning this. You have no idea what this man has done. And I've told your stories. Uh, they all know the butterscotch story. The, the butterscotch story. They know. I don't think anybody believes you, Cyrus. 
they, but it's true. I'm a really nice guy. Everybody I'm knows just shy. People can do Kunal Vijaykar stand up. I'm shy. On Cyrus says they do it for 10 10 minutes in cocktail parties. And guys, Kunal Vijaykar. Take off. I know. Yeah. So I'm shy and reticent and I avoid uh, attention. That is yeah. all I do. Yeah. Oh, to some extent, I think that's true. That's fair to say. Yeah. But but you have some great. And I get a little irritated, which I've calmed down tremendously now as in my old age. But yeah. I used to be a little. But that's more because you take rest till in the morning. Uh, no, he I takes don't it take not to go to sleep, <laughs> just to <laughs> be around people. So he sort of you know fades a little bit. That's why the tiger number didn't come to his head. <laughs> I think <laughs> already sleeping. Uh, let's quickly look at the other ads now nah, because uh, people can go and uh, check. There it out. There was another one because you won the uh, you won it twice. Some model of the year. Savlon, Savlon was yeah. uh, was a. It was yes, I think it's still there. The antiseptic product. thing, you know, like yeah, yeah, yeah. it's like Dettol. The only yeah. thing is it doesn't burn. So it does if you put it on your privates. I've never tried. You did. I was I sleeping. <laughs> no rubbish. Okay, um, tell us. Uh, so that ad also was. Uh, it was huge. Which was it huge. just remind me, what is that calling thing? I think it's just my face, and there's a hand coming in and putting uh, the the medicine on and my you go, cheek, ooh, ooh. and go. Ooh, ah, 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 ah. So he became famous yeah. for these ridiculous expressions yeah. with his funny face. Over over exaggerated facial expressions. For others, but for you, it was like normal. Yeah. yeah. I oh. make faces. Yeah, you do make faces. Yeah. And if you can make money making faces, why not? Correct. Yeah. Why not? Why yeah. not? Yeah. Then? And I made a lot of money in those days. Huh? There's one where you're playing the piano. I was, you did so many ads. Nobody the piano was, yeah. Piano was gold spot ad. I think Devan Kote. And was Preeti was Zinta the side actress or something, if I remember correctly? No, no. Preeti Zinta was uh, for a rice TV commercial. Uh, and I forget... Uh, I forget what, yeah, but she first faced the camera for the first time in her life. And you were the star? I was the star. Star means I was the. And co is it true you asked to get out of her, uh, this thing trailer? Because it was bigger than yours or something? No. What rubbish. You came and got angry. You're and making up stories now. Freaky Sintha corn hair. Never, never, never. Uh -huh. never, never. Uh -huh. But I had to kiss her on her cheek. Well, that's now Preeti Zinta's issue. No? Yeah. <laughs> I can't really ask you, but i got to talk to her about that. Yeah, yeah it's, but it's the first time she faced a camera. And the first time you kissed on screen. And maybe off screen also. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, there's a, this is like a Me Too moment. You be careful. <laughs> She's a lovely girl. Yeah. Uh. You no, went I, out with Preeti Zinta? No. You did? Not, he has dated no, a couple of Bollywood that's actresses. Not, that's not what Can I, I said. Their names? That's not what I that's said. That's what you said. No, 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 no. That's what you said. I, no, I didn't mean it. Can I, you name the two actresses he's dated, no, which I know? Shh, quiet. I can't take quiet, the names. Can I take the names? No, 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 quiet. I, I did, never dated I anybody. Did. I bloody Aisha, 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 Mashadi. 23 years. I, I, I bloody Romeo. No, I only said. Not that, so much roadside, but That anyway. was the first kiss on screen. Mm -hmm. And it's possibly the first skin, uh, kiss I ever had off screen. I uh, when you said it was a shared kiss, so it may implied no, both no, parties. No, 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 Sorry, both Preeti Sinta, this is he not what he's Preeti Sinta's in America, there's much better podcast yeah. there, yeah. And she doesn't watch this. Yeah, uh, yeah. so, uh, but, but what about the two, uh, Sparish wants us to push the probe this, we yeah, do have the time. Uh, can we discuss the two ladies you had? Uh, no, no, what I mean, I did not, <laughs> absolute nonsense. No, Very no, famous no, stars. No, 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 no famous how, stars. How no, such no. a bloody guy who's so introverted what do you say? and no, no, unfriendly? Such a what guy? What no, guy? bloody guy who, huh? who doesn't like people. How do these two girls fall for you? What is there in you that's so great? I don't know which Bujh two girls. Kya hai? This should be your next show. <laughs> Bujh mein kya hai? Should be your next show. <laughs> <laughs> There are no girls who fell for me, and there are no stars. I'm not going to take the name, Baba. There's also legal issues and all that. Please they may not be. Are nobody, happy. Nobody. Both are married. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> everybody, I've Google ever, 90s actresses. <laughs> everybody I have dated has already got married. I'm the what? only person unmarried. After now. they got married, we're dating them. No, no. See, he's, he's changing my words. <laughs> this is the man who gave us 23,000 tigers at the drop of a hat. So we don't know what you're saying. We have to read between the so lines. So if I give you the number of girls, it will also be wrong. By the way, nobody knows this. This man has dated five times more girls than I have. Really. Well, that doesn't say much, you know, Cyrus. Five is a lot. <laughs> <laughs> About you. Yeah, I know. I'm a failure. I've accepted it. But you on the other hand pretend to be a failure. I hate that. You're a fraud. That's what you really are. You're hiding behind your success. I you don't want to share it with anyone. Not true, not huh. true, not true. All right, uh, quickly, uh, before we forget, then there's a lot of films also. There's uh, Aptak Chapan, of course, is the best one that I think uh, that you've done. B and everyone knows that because that was an iconic film. But there are a few others also. Can you quickly no, go Aptak through? Chapan is, is, a, is, even today, and the thing that it keeps running on television still, hmm. so people still watch it and people still stop me and say Aptak Chapan, but it was a very good film. It's a great director. 
uh, and he was the only fellow who's ever cast me in a role where I don't have to make faces and pull faces. Yeah. So I just I just enjoyed. Thoroughly. Although you did eat a lot in some scenes. No, no, I had the one scene with Vada Pav, but that's yeah. it. Where none a particular story of food or something. No, no, nothing like that. He's, I'm just eating Vada Pav, and that's it. You but don't eat Vada Pav. You drink uh, something like that. This is how you eat Vada Pav. He's lost his mind completely. A foodie who says I eat Vada Pav like that. <laughs> I mean, guys, if you're a doctor and you can help, uh -huh. please talk to us. Talk to us now. Um, Which other film? And uh, then I did. But, but it, so, sorry, quickly to go back to that. There was also fight sequences in that. So I remember when we watched it, uh, we went I to the theater to watch it. Talk, talk, talk. No, no, there was a running and all that. You get out of the car, car and you're running. I remember we, we saw it in uh, Eros or Metro. Yeah, little, we uh, saw the whole family. Theater we saw it, preview yeah. theater. Yeah. And we couldn't believe Kunal running at full tilt. Everybody and watched this movie which just now came out. I had a little small tiny role in it. Uh, which movie? This is Anupam Kher film? No, no, no. It, that's not out yet. It's called uh, Hello Charlie or something. With right, 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 right. Playing, uh, playing uh, you know, that Ranbir Kapoor's cousin. Ranbir Kapoor's cousin. Correct, correct, yeah, yeah. correct. And there's a chase, which I'm trying to chase uh, the main lead. Yeah. And they made me run and run and run at Kalagoda. I have never run so much in my life. And with my limp and everything else. Huh? Folks, you have to check this film out, whose name we don't know, as quickly as possible, just to see him actually doing Hello, an Charlie action sequence. Linus, but there's also, if I remember correctly, you had done this Charlie's Angel Indian version, Hindi version. Cats. Cats. In that, you also, did you... No, I never ran. But you were, you no know, fight sequences. One day you were shooting on the beach and you were very tired, I remember, because you went drinking after That's that. Every time I've shot on the beach, is very tired because it's very sunny and hot and I don't like to work, so... Okay, so you, you feel that yeah, your life is yeah. uh, very stressful and that you've suffered a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can that's see. That's why nobody casts me anymore. No, no, that's not because true. You've got I a film uh, coming out with uh, Anupam Kher and Chunky. Yeah, but and I'm can't. playing an old man, okay. which I am, so. <laughs> <laughs> but you, you can't talk about it? No, it's it's in the news. So it's called... Uh, can you vaguely tell us your role without no, giving no, away the I'll film? I'll tell you, no. Oh. It's, it's called um, uh, Vijay 69. Hmm. And it's about... Vijay 69? Yeah. Bro, sounds like gay pawn to me, brother. <laughs> we just 69. It's again, numbers. Is it 69 or 67? I don't know. He doesn't know the title. He doesn't know that the fraud doesn't know the, the title. The numbers. The he numbers. shot for 20 days. He can't remember the name of the film. It's, it's that, Vijay? It's Vijay 69, I think. It's, yeah. 69? Why do they go with that? Because, because connotations. Vijay is the. Uh, He's the age is 69. Yeah, yeah. Conveniently, so they, we and have this conversation. Yeah. Well, well thought of. Well thought of. Yeah. And um, your role, sorry. No, so I'm uh, playing a friend of Anupam Kher. Okay. Yeah. And in the uh, same age Just a little bit, it's about a marathon race, can I say that It's much? about an old man trying to uh, do the triathlon. Which is, a lot of people in their 50s yeah. and 60s are yeah. doing that. So it's yeah. not like an untrue story. Uh, now, tell us about your fitness mantra because you're known to really like uh, be disciplined early morning and what do you do? Uh, I used to walk uh, five kilometers a day. But I stopped. <laughs> <laughs> I guess once you've seen the entire length and breadth of uh, Prabha Devi, there's no need to explore <laughs> any further. Prabha Devi, Wali, Sea Face and back. So for a it. short while, when we used to do that show, whose name I forget, something wasn't, hmm. you would actually go from the studio and walk home, which was a yeah, fair amount. I would walk. No, it was not actually a fair amount. It was, I had to walk extra. It would take me only 45 minutes or 40 minutes and I wanted to walk an hour. So I'd then walk around lanes inside somewhere in the middle of the afternoon in the hot sun. Yeah. All right, Kunal, uh, as we come to the end, I would want to ask you about the food industry again. Who are the guys that you like? We've never discussed this. Who are the Vijaykar's favorites, both uh, uh, on your internet as well as... Uh, as in people who make food? Make food, present food. I mean, not necessarily competition. Yeah. Food anchors, you mean? Yeah. Anchors from the from the world. My, f my favorite food anchor has been Vinod Dua. May ah. his uh, soul rest in peace. Because the kind it's of Malika's show that I started doing yeah. was vaguely based on his show. So he did it in Hindi. Malika, he copied your dad's show and Abe sir had a heart attack immediately listening to that. Yeah. Huh. So, but so he was one of the, he was the first uh, TV show, food show, uh, which was not chef based, right. which was not cooking based, but which was eating based, is which is what we did with uh, for the food eight times now. Mm -hmm. So I Did you ever shoot with him? Never, never. I met him once. But he was a great supporter of our show though. Yes. Ah, week yes. that wasn't. Yes. Yeah, his daughter doesn't so, like me. No, she does. <laughs> Um, Maybe she likes me too much, Malika. So he's great. Um, and out of the people who make food, my favorites are all my street side stalls that we visit and the best food comes out of there. No, but you've um, got your perennial favorites like Jafar Bhai. And I know you won't be able to remember I mean. all the names. Uh, yeah. Jafar Bhai, my Raju Malwani fellow, yeah. um, uh, my Babulnath Pani Puri. 
सो दीज आर माई फेवरेट ऑल आर रेगुलर सब्सक्राइबर्स आर आर ओलम्पिया भेजा वट एल्स सारवी कबाब सो दीज आर माई वेजिटेरियन लिस्निंग Um, you give us one bhelpuri well i'll tell you honestly uh, neelam food hall of food land in khar they sell you undiu which is delicious oh abad loves undiu really nice undiu oh excellent will you if i go us? to khar i got it yesterday sir is to your house but i say for yesterday it. you don't want to eat it that's true then what's the deal okay uh, foreign guys what were the gordon ramsay and all about that but he died Yeah, but what can I do if he died? So true, did we not do a? But he was more like a tour guide. But, come, but that's is that what, what you not. would really like to do? Yeah, that's yeah. what I would like. So why to do, do they make you do this? I don't. Uh, I'm not a chef. IFC First Bank show over general knowledge and all. This will be more your thing. Speak to IVM. Yeah. So uh, before we end, what happens to the food show in 2024? Is there any spectacular new thing? Are you going to do a? Sh- are you going to do a set of awards or like a? No, but I'm trying to do a third anniversary special. Uh, okay. Uh, maybe a ground event. Uh, trying to figure out what to do exactly and what the nature of that event will be, uh, but I hope to start. We hope to start adding content onto the channel. At the moment, there are only two shows a week that happen. Oh, you mean like a twenty-four hour food channel? No, no, that's not, no. On the channel that we have, the Karmik Air YouTube channel, mm-hmm. at the moment has two shows, two episodes that go on every week. I want to reach a point where we can do no, four a week. Five so a you week. mean you'll have other people presenting? Yeah, other people. I mean, I may so do a second show. I will do a second show. Why would you want to tire yourself out doing so much? Oh, uh, I mean, you seem tired at this know. podcast. Yeah, yeah. So that I can retire. Okay. I'll work hard now for one year and then right retire. Okay. Kula has been excellent talking to you. I I really, can see the enthusiasm on his face. I really enjoyed uh, myself talking to you. Uh, unfortunately, people in the studio have all faded away. Uh, they've all lost the oxygen, and we'll have to call people in to help. Has it revive. been one hour? It sounded like it's two hours. It's not exactly actually. one hour. It's a little less than that. But the people are asking. They're emailing us and saying, "Shut up, f up, and all that." You know, yeah. the one guy's gone. He's gone straight into Jabalpur area to count tigers because he's so upset about. <laughs> he's like, "Daddy, daddy, they come, they come, they come." And you know, because you've just you know, the apple cart has been tumbled by you. Uh, but we do have the AMA section actually. Which I we normally keep for special guests. But now you've asked everybody. Today's <laughs> kele to nahi hai. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Okay, it's fine, Cyrus. But uh, be, before we go, can we do leave? Uh, sometimes huh? you get these uh, emails and you're not there. Can uh, we don't have the makeup? Obviously, can you play? Um, you sort of do the knuckle of one of your characters from T W T. Oh yeah, I can't. I've lost huh? my voice. Can so, you do without taking names an erstwhile leader of the country who was female? Yes, that that was wonderful. Or a famous uh, singer who was female. Oh, no names. No, no, forget. Please. The, the voice will not come because it now. The gone. voice was never there. <laughs> <laughs> Then you wouldn't be working this stupid line. You'll be a superstar. I think we should just cut to a picture of that. You won't do anything for these people who waited so long to see your talent. They are not waiting to see my uh, 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 what is it called mimicry. They email us all the time. Why can't we see Kunal really? in this avatar, that avatar? What do you think, man? We'll, we'll and do, all said and we'll, done, we'll do the in nine hundred episodes a week, that wasn't alone. I'm not counting stage shows <coughs> and all that. You must have played, I would say, uh, with repeat characters, close to seven hundred characters. Okay, with the fact that we repeat uh, certain characters are obviously yeah, repetitive. Yeah, yeah, Five yeah. to seven hundred characters would have been played. That would be a serious body of work. Now, if you say eighty percent was rubbish, twenty percent was good. That's not bad, bro. You should be proud of yourself. Who said eighty percent was rubbish? Ninety. Chalo. <laughs> <laughs> Kunal Vijayakar, it's been a pleasure. Uh, thank you for everything. And are you coming for dinner to our house, and will you be bringing food? I will probably come for dinner. I think your daughter is fighting with me right now, but we'll figure that out. If you do want to know why, it's because my son Mikhail lay on her bed in his football clothes, and uh, Kunal was laughing and not telling him to get off. <laughs> the ideal parent, the best friend, the greatest anchor, the finest mimic, and above all, a humanitarian. Kunal. श्री विजयकर